Uh, the St Patrick's Festival announcement went a bit heavy-handed with the old progressivism, didn't it? Minister Martin uh, did a good sense to wear some green, as, it, as did a handful of others. But front and centre were bizarrely women and girls in what appeared to be Spanish-style flamenco dresses. I spotted two cowboys, some girls in an odd sort of beetle costume, like something out of a Marvel movie. And of course, the ever-present uh, men in women's face, who apparently uh, must be included in every public display, lest the government risk the air of terminally online woke Twitter addicts. But it was more than a questionable decision, many feel, to place a young girl of about eight, three feet away from a man a man's crotch bulging out of a tiny lace tights and underwear to take photos showing that and then say, yep, that's what we want to represent Ireland internationally and run with it. I find myself agreeing with many citizens online who voiced the opinion that maybe instead of the fascistic exposure at our St Patrick's Day parade, we just have St Patrick. It worked very well for the past 400 years.